Today, we co I'm coming to y'all from just outside Cheyenne, Wyoming. I'm on my way to Seattle from St. Louis and then down to uh, Los Angeles. I want to give y'all a brief lesson here, but it's real important. Take a look and tell me what hazards do you see. Not the pile of rocks, but weather-wise. So now I'm going to step out of the truck and show you what the hazard is. Oh, man. Just pushing the door. I can't even open it. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Well, you can see I can't hardly open the door, but I'm going to try again. That's how strong this wind is. So when you get wind like that, you want to stop. Let's try to skip. Maybe I'm crazy. Oh, man. Well, anyway, y'all get the hint. So take a look here. Let me move the window. You can get an idea. I'm going to hold it with both hands. See all these trucks? Campers. These campers will get blown right off the road, flipping right over. They'll flip right over. All the way out there. See guys sitting down there. On the shoulder, all some are back on the other side of the the thing there. Let's see. There are the other guys. These are 65, 70 mile an hour winds now. Roll the window up. These are 65, 70 mile an hour wind gusts, and they'll just blow you right over. Some people will tell you, I had a dispatcher tell me a few years ago, oh, we had other guys go through there. Now watch, look at that guy right there. Let's see if I can blow it up. See, he's got no wind drag. He can just roll. But those guys, you can get through. They'll tell you, oh, well, these guys, we had skin guys do there all the time. Yeah. Yeah. But you'll be the one that flip over. You'll be the one get blown off the road. Then you won't be able to get a job again. Because you're stupid. Your life is at risk. Well, you don't listen to somebody in a cubicle. Anyway, that's the lesson for today. See you on the next one.